Get on here first thing. Start doing this fucking up. Mm. And we live, baby. Believe it or not, nigga, you only one with the headphones in, right? So anytime I do this thing, I can't hear it. Oh, so yeah, mean, yeah. mean it. So if I do something like that, you got to talk. First off, you got to be near the microphone. Let's get it. Let's get it. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm really finna bring out the whole city. The whole, the whole, the whole of the whole of the city. Because I turned it up like that. Is that why family? Want to live here? You live right now? Yeah. We got ready, man. We got like jumping in, though. We just kind of letting letting the time roll in. Eight thirty on the dot. Eight thirty on the dot. It's time to drop. drop. Make it do what it do, what not. So, let's see. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Jumped over to another one. Uh oh. Um, uh, my, my sister, she said, can she cut off? Can she do it now? Mm -hmm. I thought, can she do it? I don't know. Recording in progress. Hold on, let me stop it over here. She can try to jump in with it, fuck it. Let's make it do what it do. Set the level good. You gotta be sure you remember. You gotta be sure you talking to the mic. If you're gonna be on the phone the whole time, we can't do the video and the phone. No, I was you got to cut, link. cut the phone off and then you put a pin that sent the link. You just still send the link at me. Yeah. Post the link on your page. <laughs> you gotta put the phone on goddamn motherfucking uh do not disturb mm. or put it on uh your, your focus mode. Yeah. <clears throat> These iPhones, you know. Right, exactly, man. You, you, LD, everybody be calling you, huh? You gonna go live on the bitch? Mm. You gonna go live on the bitch? What's the answer now? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I can go live on mine. Exactly. <laughs> Yo! What's up? It's your boy, Torian. It's your host of over there for the Destroyed Cosmos. Yeah, that's what I said. The Distorted Cosmos. Right here is my kinfolk Stoner LD. So, you know, it probably ain't gonna be a whole lot of people jumping on my live because again, I'm just not starting my page up. But he's gonna go live on his page. We're going live on the podcast. We on the Zoom. Remember when you're looking, look right here. Don't look over here. Don't fuck it up for everybody. Talk into the microphone. So let's get this shit started. First and first, first thing and foremost. April 23rd. Yes, sir. April 23rd. What is that? Hey, 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 yo. yo. <laughs> hey, yo, man. <laughs> hey, boy, I try to block out the whole camera, man. Boy. So maybe got to get this man stand over here as well. I'm probably going to do a switch my stand around since, you know, I know who I know who am I. You know, that's my baby. Hey, hey, baby, what's going on? So what we're going to do, we're going to switch him around so he can get set up for his 10,000 followers, you know. That's just a respect yeah. thing, you know. Just a respect. Because I'm a respectable man right there, you know. Move the bag up. Move the bag up the way. Slap it over there on the side. What's up? What's up? We're going to slide that right back there. We live, we live. Say, don't forget to share this, okay? Uh, yeah, even YouTube. 
little, little lady. Shout out to all these people who are, uh, you know, can listen to the podcast. Because, yeah, why not? So, yeah, don't forget to tap the link. The link is in the bio. I'm going to go ahead and shut this down so I can focus on him because he, he got it over here. But, yeah, he got it over here. So I'm going to talk to his people on my side, his side. Stay tuned. Fuck with your boy. He and he's live. What's up, Woods? What's up, what's up, what's up? What's up, what's up? What's up? Okay, so the motherfucker all white party is coming up. The all white party is coming up, motherfucker, April 23rd. And let me yes, tell sir. you. April 23rd, I'm shutting the city down. Shut shutting the, the city, whole city down. down. We going live over here too. So we got, so excuse us, we were looking both ways. We looking right here. We looking this way. We looking both ways. So shit. Y'all bear with me. This is my first time in the setup. So, you know. And this is a, very, time, this, so. this is a fairly new setup. It's going to be, it's going to be some changes coming to this shit, it's but shit, time, you so. got to start out where you at, you know? You got to start out where you at, you know? One of them think we got money. You come in and start out at the top. Hell no, we got, we starting out right here. We starting that right here on the free free. We 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 gonna have a big studio, you know. Yes, we are. You know, we gonna have a big studio. Uh, you know, uh, lot 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 of those things is coming. Coming, coming, coming. But until then, you know, right right now we uh sitting at the crib with the periodic table behind us. You know what I mean? That's lit. Say, say if you don't know nothing about this periodic table right here, they got some new elements. You know, uh, palladium, Americanum, A M E R I C I U M. The it's A M. Educate them. The, the atomic weight is ninety five. Educate them. Some people may know what I'm talking about. Some people may not. If not, go Google it. Check it out. You can teach us teach teach your people something new. You know. And and then that's not a lot of things. A lot of people, it, it's a lot of new information out here that a lot of people just don't want to give away. Like like you remember we we was talking about that earlier. How it's a lot of it's a lot of ways that people can help people, but instead of them putting you on, they they'll just give you just enough to have you w within reach, right. but not you know helping you out. Right. It's always a, okay, I got to benefit, 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 benefit. You, you gonna have to lose until I'm at the point to where now I'm benefiting enough to where I can help you out. Right. But before we get to the philosophy, philosophy and, you know, and, and the deep dive into that first thing we're going to do is we got to continue to talk about this all white party. So this all white party is coming out on motherfucking April 23rd. Now, what time is it going to be speaking to the mic? Tell people what time is going to be. April 23rd, my time or the club time? <laughs> okay, wait, wait, wait. So for anybody, all y'all know, everybody on IG know him. Anybody who knows Stone LD, for anybody who don't know Stone LD, he's a man of, he's a man of entrance. Oh, nigga, he'd be sh sh sharp as motherfucker on this side of I-35, right? But uh, <laughs> he gonna get there when he get there. So again, the club hours is what is what time? The club, the club hours, hours. From 10 to 2. At the side, at the sidebar. at the sidebar. Club so the club out for ten to two. So yeah, they gonna pull up about what 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 time? He gonna make his grand entrance about what time? I'm going to arrive. Let's see, here we 12 go. Twelve ish, twelve thirty, between twelve and 12, yeah, around that time. That's that's that's, 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 that's that bullshit, 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 bullshit. That's that bullshit. That's that bullshit. He told me, he told me. Yeah, D. Hey, what's up? Yeah. yeah. They told him he can't fuck around. Bring your ass here in a timely manner, okay? For the, for those of you, called me today and told me that was like, man, LD, we know your birthday coming up. You can't be, you can't be putting up to the club extra late, man. Man, because he be Last pulling up extra up late. Like hey, how y'all doing on the Zoom? I wasn't trying to, but it just happened like that. You know, life happens. You know, you can't, you really can't control what happens in life sometimes. So you just have to just. Roll with it and keep it moving. Just got to make it do what it do. Make it do what you it do. just got to make it do what it do. So for all of y'all who are joining the Zoom link, I don't know what you can and can't see right now. This is our first time doing, doing this, up, you know, man? in this particular way. Please but see. yeah. So we just want to say thank y'all for joining. And again, we're talking about the all white party that's going down April 23rd. All white. At the sidebar. Okay. The time frame. The sidebar will be open for 10 p.m. 
to 2 p.m. Now, another thing that we got to talk about is we know it's going to be a tough. How much, how much is it going to cost to get in this motherfucker? We you know, starting off at $200. If you don't have $200, like, you don't even need to be stepping outside, period. Like, if you don't have $200, man, who don't have $200? I mean, it's income tax time, man. It's exactly. I ain't got my shit yet. But shit, ladies, who got the income tax? Who don't have two $10 bills? Like, who don't have two $10 me, mother. <laughs> I ain't got to do that bill. No, nah, I missed the witch. But uh, yeah, so so the price to get in that motherfucker is twenty twenty dollars. Twenty bucks. Twenty bucks. Twenty. 20, to get in. 20 big ones. Okay. Now, another thing we gotta talk about. What's the vibe? Like, Man, say the like, vibe is gonna be a sexy vibe. So sexy baddies everywhere. Okay. Bottles. Okay. VIP status. It's gonna be it's gonna be a sexy vibe, man. It's gonna be bottles. It's gonna be beautiful women everywhere. Beautiful women breaking the whole city out. Everybody rocking bottles. Like it's, it's it's gonna be crazy, man. It's gonna be Ooh. real epic, like for real, for real. Ooh, I can't man. wait. Oh, shout out to everybody that's like that's been sending me like the uh, videos and pictures of what they wearing, man. What they done already bought. I appreciate that love for real, man. <clears throat> Shout out to everybody that's just taking time out their busy schedule, their busy life to just, you know, fuck with me, you know. Yeah, that's a that's that's a that's a respect right there, in his, you know, in his own, like for real. And that's See? love. I appreciate that for real, for real. Like, so, like I said, if you if you if you send in your pictures to Stony LD again, we really want to appreciate it for all of y'all who uh, follow us on IG. Don't forget to follow um, the T H E underscore distorted d-i-s-t-o-r-t-e-d underscore cosmos c-o-s-m-o-s -S. say it again say it again the t-h-e underscore d-i-s-t-o-r-t-e-d underscore cosmos that's the name of the podcast and yeah we're gonna keep this thing rolling so sexy vibe we got the baddies okay oh, i now, want to mention another thing too i'm gonna have yeah. uh i'm gonna have chocolate filled with strawberries in my VIP section too. Chocolate in the VIP strawberries. section. I'm gonna, Ooh. Do I'm, gonna, I'm gonna have a chocolate cup of strawberries in my VIP section this, this year for my white birthday party for the baddies. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, why? Oh, why? Oh, 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 okay, you, see, we're gonna, we never... we gonna have the gloves on too. Feed me with the gloves on. Please. Safe. Say, oh, wait, wait, wait. With feed? Yeah. Hold on. Oh, oh, oh hey, yo. <laughs> Bing bong. Fuck your life. <laughs> <laughs> Who getting fed around this bitch? What, what? So we're gonna fit like so. Um, what I decided to do this year, I was like, man, you know, everybody I always come out and support me. So it was like, you know what? Yeah. It's fruits. Mm -hmm. It's healthy. It's healthy. Yeah. It's chocolate. Ain't healthy. You know who don't like strawberries and chocolate? Who don't like chocolate covered strawberries? It's be a lot. It's a lot of people, but. Hopefully you can stay your ass at the house. We ain't trying to have that shit. <laughs> you fucking with the chocolate and the strawberries, pull up, yeah. pull up, okay? I'm feeding, I will have chocolate strawberries. Say, speak, speaking of chocolate strawberries, look, 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 talk to us. look, look. So one time I threw my wife a little party, right? Okay. I cooked for her and everything. And uh, I invited a couple of her friends over and I just kind of, I catered to them a little bit. Okay. And I had some chocolate covered strawberries, but see what I did was I cut the strawberries in half and I only dumped them half in chocolate. And she was like, why are you dumping them half in chocolate? I said, cause I just want to give them a tip of it. If I give them the whole thing, these ladies don't want to stay. So I just got to give them a tip of the chocolate and a taste of it, a taste of what you getting on the daily. Right. Well, let me tell you, they, they ate this, ate it up. Ate it up, ate it up. up. <laughs> ate, it up. <laughs> ate it up. So yeah, you got it. So it's going to be grown and sexy. Y'all hear the vibe already? Uh oh. Yeah, y'all hear the vibe already. Uh, it's gonna be growing and sexy strawberries and shit in the VIP, man. So look here, another thing we gotta mention too, um, the past parties, right? The past parties was, my God, like so fucking lit. Like we had the line around the fucking building. Like that shit was turned up. So please do get there in a reasonable amount of time. My first all white birthday bash I ever did in life. Like, let me give y'all the back. Let me give y'all the background. Let me give y'all the first. My first all white party I ever did in Dallas. I did a club zoo. And Triple D. Like, Triple D. Downtown Dallas. Like, uh, I didn't expect that many people to come out and rock with me, to be honest. Like, 
to be honest, I didn't even expect that many people. I, I didn't expect anything. I just promoted my party. I was having a birthday party and I was like, this where I'm gonna have it at. Y'all pull up, y'all rock with me. Let me tell you, the love was real. Out. The love was real. Like, it like pulled up and showed out. Like we had a good ass time. Only thing I can say is it was some baby mamas in there squabbling with some bitches for nothing. You remember that shit? <laughs> I ain't gonna say who baby even, mama it was. But, lie, but I, I, I yeah, it, remember, it, wasn't, it wasn't his baby I mama. Remember, like, I remember, I, I was so standing, we all was standing so right there and we was all having a good time. It was at the end of the party too. That's the crazy thing about it. Like we had been chilling the whole night Damn. and she gonna come and just cause her baby dad was dancing on somebody else. Dancing on somebody else, then she gonna go and steal off on the bitch. I'm like, what the fuck? I don't think they were together at that point in time. I think that was, regardless of what it was, that's none of my business. But still, we ain't having none of that shit. Come on now, don't fuck it up for everybody. We just, man, Will Smith just slapped the nigga. Come on, man. <laughs> it's the same type of shit. Like, don't come over here, Will Smith, and nobody. Okay? Good vibes only, man. Good vibes, Good vibes only. only bro. Like, like, for real. You know, you see, the thing is, at the house. we don't need none of that. So look, I, I, I'm explaining to y'all. For a lot of people who don't know, one of the things, one of the reasons why we go to the club is for that energy, is for that vibe. When a lot of people say, what's the vibe? Like, what's, what's the vibe? So what the vibe is, is you know when you, when, when that bum ass song come on and everybody sing it at the same time, they, oh shit, you know, they kind of, we, we all know what it is. We, not, we all know, know the feel, we all know, that's the vibe, that's the mood. We all coming to get that wave of energy, right? right. We all coming to be turned up. We are, cause we be, it's a fucking pandemic, that making people go back to work now, even though we've proven multiple times that we can do everything remotely, right? Why in the fuck are we got to go back to the office? But I digress. Anyway, the energy, the vibe, the way we come in to feel that. So everybody's coming for a feel good vibe. We coming for a feel good mood. Why would, you know, we want to steadily ruin this for somebody else. Like if you're not having a bad day, baby girl, homeboy, big homie, big bro, whoever you is, stay at home. Nigga. Don't come <laughs> over here with all that bullshit, bro. Like right. we coming up to chill out. Right. We coming up to, you know, turn up. We trying to relax. Everybody got a lot of clothes that they've been having in the closet about two years. Right. <laughs> Everybody people, trying to hey, step out. People are buying outfits. They get outfits made, you know, not to mention, you know, they, Man, people ordering stuff like we don't need none of that drama. We'll keep that drama at the high. Speaking like, speaking of ordering stuff, uh, this podcast is currently sponsored by the distortedcosmos.com. If you would like to pick up some merchandise, please head over to www.the distortedcosmos.com. Pick yourself up a lock hat. If you know, I can't see I have a very luscious locks right now. And uh I just made a little hat that says the distorted cosmos on it. I'm working, I'm looking for vendors who want to partner up within the Dallas, Texas, Metro, within the Dallas, Texas Metroplex area, metropolitan area. Um, yeah, so I'm pretty sure you got some people on here. Y'all get at him to get at me so we can uh, do some work. We can do some business with each other. We can partner up with each other. I know a lot of black businesses out here that's trying to thrive. This is how we thrive right here. We share, we connect, we thrive, we turn up. Back to the party. Right. Back to the park. Anyway, the vibe. Dress code. Grown and sexy, right? Yep, grown and sexy. Please do not call me and ask what to wear. Like, I feel like we are at a certain point in our life where you should know how to dress when somebody ain't watching. You talking about men or women? Men and women. Diamond, what's up? Diamond, what's up? I'm live. So, what would you... I feel for, like... For, for the fellas who trying to figure out what kind of outfit to put on? Get give them a couple of pointers, cause you 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 you're, you're a pr pretty swaggy guy, pr pr pretty drippy, drippy sauce in this bitch, you know, saucing. I feel like if a guy asks me, "Hey, LD, what should I wear to your birthday party?" First and foremost, collar, collar, you know, pop, you know, poppy shit, man, you know, collar shirt. Fitted jeans, some nice shoes. Fitted. Everybody can't. Everybody can't afford designer, so you know, just wear something nice that you can afford that you feel comfortable with. That's how I dress. Bro. Yeah. I don't really care about designer. Like, whatever. I have a couple. I have designer pieces, but I don't really gotta just go out and about like just. Oh, I gotta have it. Nah. So as but long as it's nothing. If I'm comfortable, like, if, yeah. if I'm comfortable, 
and I and I look good in what I'm what I'm wearing, like I'm gonna go out and, and wear that. Like, you know? Yeah, I feel you. Whether it cost me five dollars, a hundred dollars, two hundred dollars, five hundred dollars, you know, like it don't matter. Like I'm gonna wear it with confidence. It don't matter what it don't matter how much it costs. Like, Except I'm gonna wear that shit with confidence. Wear it with confidence, man. And that's what a lot of people don't have though, is confidence, bro. Like you gotta be confident in your own self and your own skin. Like regardless, your own skin. You gotta be confident in you. And ladies, we already know y'all confident, ladies. You know, y'all come through, you know, wearing them little pretty ass dresses with them pretty ass heels on, have y'all like got the bras on and shit. Can you hear me? Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? Can you hear me? Miss Cleo. Can you hear me now? They good? They talking about shit they can't hear me. Yeah. Yeah. Can y'all hear me on love? Can y'all hear me? We having some technical difficulties again. We doing this shit brand new. Yes, no. We getting in here. Getting in that thing. Yeah. Yeah. But anyway, so the dress code. Missy. Yeah. <laughs> Missy over here on the Zoom. What happened? Uh, Is she talking over there too? Nah, yeah, Cause she, I can't see over there. She, uh, I think she on the Zoom. People on the Zoom ain't on live. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they on both of them. They on both. Okay. Okay. Fucking with them. Uh, okay. Appreciate <laughs> man, it. Man, get on that wave, everybody. Say, if you listen to us uh, on the, on live right now, hey, how you doing? If you listen to us on the Zoom right now, hey, how you doing? And shout out to everybody that's on Zoom shout right out. now. Shout out. So, so uh, when we get done with this, this is going to be posted on YouTube. Uh, so you can go check us out at uh, The Distorted Cosmos. Just search that up on YouTube. Boom, it's gonna come up. We got a playlist of all the past, all all the past podcasts. <clears throat> also, if you go on my, uh, if you can look me up on Spotify, the podcast is up on Spotify as well. Uh, if you got an iPhone, pull up the podcast app on your iPhone. The Distorted Cosmos. Boom, we in there too. So yeah, we in there. We we all over. Okay. So dress code, grown and sexy. It's going to be a relaxed, chill ass vibe. Okay. The past parties, we don't have people out there. Shit done been turned up. Like shit been around the corner. Like I'm talking. You remember my lad, the one I did, uh, what, was, what club was that? Uh, that was Medusa. We had Days Love. See? I had Days Love at one of my. Office. I was in Vegas on that one. So. In Vegas. Yeah. It was like Days Love and she a legend. Like, you know, so it's, it's crazy. She came out and, and turned it up for the city, huh? It's probably that case. What is it? Can you hear me now? Man, we having technical difficulties. Everything is brand new to us, but guess what? We working with it. We working through it. People is working with us and we appreciate that. And like I said, you know, we- If I got a hold it. We're young. Young businesses, oh, the, you know, the speaker part right here. That's why y'all couldn't hear me. Mm, okay, the speaker part was covered up. Okay, what's going on, Sydney? What's up, baby? Okay, so now they can hear us. Okay, we was kind of shut down for a second. Y'all can hear me now. What's going on? Hey, everybody on live. What's going on? Bro? Hey, hey, hey. <clears throat> okay, so now we got that live figured out. All right, man. So the dress code is coming up. The all white board is coming up. Shit finna be litty, man. Right. So, um, what else you got on your mind right now, bro? Man, right now, I just want to just, I want to stay focused in life. Like? And just progress, keep progressing, man. So, like, where, where are you at in life? Like, 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 what? What 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 stages are you at in life? You know, and the reason why I ask that is because everybody goes through, you know, shit in their lifetime, right? right? So, but we all, you know, have to emerge and grow. So, right. you know, or you at that grind stage, like, like, or you at that um, coasting stage, or you, you know, what, like, like, where is it, where is Stoner LD in his life, in his grind, in his journey? I'm hungry. Hungry. I'm hungry, man. Like, not playing no games. I'm hungry. I'm staying focused. It's all my life to keep progressing. That's the only reason, you know, they, they it, it should be, it should be st steady growth. Right. You know what I mean? 
Right. Like steady growth. So so another thing, another thing I want to ask you: what message would you give to the young people out here? Like like a young 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 dude, he you know, sen- senior in high school, right? He, in high school yeah like 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 he, he look up to you he don't really know what he want to do in life what kind of advice would you give him the reason i ask is because i went viral a few weeks ago on fa- fa- facebook so a young man in the soto uh he creeped up on somebody's back back porch and she caught him on the uh on the nest camera Right. So then, you know, he, he, you know, it was three of them. So one of them, so two of them seen the camera and back, back. And one of them was like, nah, bro, come up on me. He went to go in this lady backyard. Now, look, now, luckily she, she just yelled at him to get the fuck out of my backyard. Right. But had she bust on the ass, he would have been dead. It would have been dead. dead. Then you have people. Oh no, you shouldn't do that. You shouldn't. He was so young. He was a good kid. He was out there breaking in the lady shit. Right. Right. So I put on there, you need to talk to your people. You need to ho- holler at your people. So so it, so if a young man didn't know what was going on with his life and you had to talk to him, what kind of words of wisdom would you give that young man about life? I would basically, first and foremost, I would sit down and talk to him and see where he at, see where he's headed at first and foremost. I mean, obviously he's lost. Right. Give him some words of wisdom. Like, basically tell them, like, you need to really, you know, think about every decision you make. Because the decision you make in two seconds can change your life, you know? So you got to be careful. You got to be conscious of what you do when you're in the world and who you're around. Because, like I said, Will Smith, <laughs> if you listen to <laughs> this. These small decisions you make in your life will be everlasting. They will constantly affect you and everyone around you. I apologize. Continue. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, man, say. But now, if you're a youngster out there and you lost in the world, you don't know what to do, get a job, go to school, get a trade. Just stay focused. Get Get a trade. Yeah, get a trade. So you like, know what I would tell them? Don't try to compare yourself to nobody else. Correct. Be yourself. This is your race. This is a one-on-one race. Don't yeah. try to compare yourself to nobody else. Everybody. And then, yeah. you, gotta, and then you gotta let you also gotta love tell them like, okay, you gotta think about the decision. Okay, if you finna do this, if you finna make a decision, is it gonna affect your family? Is it gonna affect you? Yeah. Your kids. Yeah. Like you really gotta be careful on how you, you know, how you how you do stuff in life. Because it can affect not only you, but everybody that's around you. Literally, a lot everybody. Of people, a lot of people don't think about that. They just go out here and just do shit without thinking, you know? Woo! Like, like on a daily, on a daily. There's so many young men out here, and young women too, who, who just don't have a plan. Right. Right? I mean, but like I said, who really teaches that type of shit in school? And then a lot of people now who are just out... Out, out here who may not think, you know, oh man, I'm good, I'm Gucci, but are you really? Right. I mean, like we we have to be honest with with where we are in our in our lives. And like it it took me really getting honest with myself. Like I got out the army and I thought, okay, me being in the army was a good stepping stone, but now what? Because I'm out. Right. I mean I didn't get get out on the negative term, but I was like What's my plan? What's the next step in life? Yeah, well, what's the next step in life? Where do I go so, from here? So, you know, I wound up getting get, getting a job and I, I wrote down my why. Why am I doing this? Why am I grinding so hard? Why do I want to fucking, you know, like, like we all have to have a reason to motivate us. We all have to have a driving reason. So we have to be sure that you figure out your why, right? I mean, like some people have 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 kids. You gotta write it down as well. Shit, but most definitely, most definitely. I tell people like, like it. A lot of people don't believe that magic is real, right? Correct. But, but we talk about manifestations all the time. 
So I'm telling you, if you want to man, manifest some shit, it, it starts in your mind, right? Correct. And then once you write it down, now you're kind of, you make yourself mentally accountable. And once you see it, now you realize if you don't at least try that, you're failing that, you're failing yourself. You're failing yourself. You're failing you did yourself. Already, you did already wrote it down. So you know what you got to do. You got to follow the steps. And you got to follow the steps because you know what you want to do, right? I'm so, all right, yeah. Having some technical difficulty on live, you know, it's internet connection and shit. Keep going in, up and down. We we out here in the country and shit. So, but yeah, on the flip, on the flip side, of it, you gotta write it down. You gotta have have a plan. You gotta make gotta make it do what it, do what it do. Because if not, you're gonna be in that bitch lost, bro. And you and you're gonna be out here just kind of doing whatever for whatever reason. And then I believe that that's how people can influence you in order for you to go head on and do whatever they feel for is necessary. I feel as if this is how people manipulate young ladies to become pro prostitutes. Right. You give them a drive. You give them a motivation. This is the same reason why young men get roped into games. Right. Because if they don't have a reason or a motive or they don't have no family or no reason to feel protected in or, life. you know, in life, like if they don't feel supported, well, this group of guys said they'll support me if I support else. them. Yeah. Right. So we, we we have to continue to be a positive influence on our community. Gotcha. Yeah. Totally agree with that. Positive influence. And like I said, you know, I'm not going to like I'm perfect. We not, yeah. I, 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 I'm not a role model. Wow. <laughs> not, I'm not a role, role model. model at all. Yeah, like, but, real. but but I got kids, yeah. and I want them to do better than I've done. Correct. Right. I want them to see a few more things than I see. I want them to to see and and, and go a few a few more more places than I have. Right. Absolutely. But, but I've done a lot of stupid shit too. We both have. <laughs> we learn from it, man. We learn from it. We grow. We learn from it. Right. So you remember old girl in the car? Oh. <laughs> do I? Do I? Man, you can't face that. Do I? Yeah. I remember. DeSoto. Oh, my God. DeSoto. Say, we just Epic me. night. Say, epic night. Be, Crazy night. Be around the city. Having fun. Epic night, like that was it, man. So, but yeah, we got to continue to be a positive, positive force, right? And that's because if you if you, if you think about you know, uh, fucking water, it's steady, it's steadily flowing, correct? Right, it's steadily flowing. So no matter what, life is steady flowing. So we got to no matter what we did in the past is about what we doing now in the direction that we're moving now. We're moving forward. We're moving towards positivity. We're moving towards growth. We're trying to fucking start businesses, right? We're trying to grow business, successful businesses. We ain't just starting no bullshit. We're trying to be successful in our steps. We're trying to be calculated. We're trying to be well mannered. Like, yeah, these these are all the things that I feel in which we should be. You know, uh, these are things that I feel that we should all be trying and trying to, to look for in our life growth in shit every aspect of our life because if we're not growing if we're not thriving if we ain't getting money what are you doing if, what are you doing what are you doing what my, baby, oh, oh my god dress lady just doing? tapped in she's making the dresses okay okay she just tapped in okay how you say say that hmm? oh the bottom <laughs> Dress lady, she from Chicago. She from the shy. Call her D. D. She's residing on the south side right now. And look, she just checked in. Lisa just checked in. Miss Graham, how you doing, Miss Graham? And look, you gotta excuse me, Miss Graham, because this is my first time working this this Zoom app on the podcast, like the way we getting our people. So on the next one. We're gonna be able to bring you on, baby, so we can have a back and forth, okay? But today, today, this time, 
We ain't gonna be able to do it right now because I don't know how to work it, but charge it to my head, not to my heart, okay? Appreciate it, appreciate it. We're getting better at we this. We appreciate you tuning in. Though. We appreciate you tuning we'll in. Please that. share it out uh, on the IG live. Uh, as soon as we post it up on YouTube, as soon as we post it up on everything, don't forget to hit that share button. Um, We're talking about the all white, April 23rd. We're April talking 23rd. about positivity. Positivity, you know? good vibes. We're talking about growth. We're talking about just, this is not just about my birthday party. This is about growth, basically growth. This is it's it's, it's it's about change. You got to change your mindset. Yeah, you know what? I, I just did a podcast about changing your mindset, right? So look, if if you look at yourself today, and you look at who you were three years ago, right? Are you that same person? Absolutely not. Or or your goals? You know, <laughs> you know, like like have they changed? Have they grown? Absolutely. Exactly. That's what it's all about. It's all about change. It's all about growth. And you will never change and grow with keeping the same mindset about the same bullshit. Correct. So you got to grow. You got to continue to thrive. Again, caterpillars change into butterflies. Okay. Sometimes they change into moths. But whatever you change into, goddamn it, be you. Be the best of what you can do. Find your niche. Niche down to whatever you can do. A unicorn can, can only be so beautiful. Right. right, but I, I feel that's... like in life, like you have to just, like you say, find your niche and run with it. Like, cause who is like, how can somebody tell you, like, what to do with your life? Nobody can tell you what to do with your life. Only you. you know? Only you can make the, those choices, and that's because you no miss, matter what nobody tell you, right? Version of yourself. No, no matter what nobody tell you, right? You gotta put forth your two feet. Correct. To make a conscious effort to manifest whatever you want. Ain't nobody gonna give you shit. At all. <laughs> At all. At all. Right? Or else you would have had it. <laughs> or else you would have had it. You gotta <laughs> you gotta continue to work. You gotta continue to create. Have gotta, fun. Have fun. You gotta have fun. No matter what. But look, I'm not a I'm not a fan of suffering. Okay. Right. And I'm not a fan of fucking working myself tired. So look, I'm I'm gonna ask you this. So if you had the the choice of grinding hard and making your way to 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 the top for a million dollars, or I can give you ten million dollars now. Now I been gave it to you, right? So you you ain't grinding for it, but you but if you grind for it. And you know, see, if you was to give me ten million right now, which one? I would, which I would, one I would, would you take? The ten million, or are you gonna grind grind for it? I would grind for my own money. And and yeah. and <laughs> I'm, I'm taking that ten million. Taking I'm first off. If a motherfucker tell me I'm gonna give you 10 million right now, that's enough to start off. Regardless of whatever else going on, at least you can start with something. Correct. <laughs> right? Correct. But if you grind it, you where you at already. You've been grinding this whole time. Absolutely. You've been grinding this whole your whole life, you've been grinding. So if somebody give you a stepping stool, a shortcut, your pad, no, I'm gonna grind it out. We oh yeah. Oh, you see, you see, the, the podcast is only supposed to go on here for a couple of minutes. So let me see if I can update this right here. You know what? I'm going to just go ahead on and in the Zoom. I'm going to come back on the Zoom. Miss Nisa, I see you sitting here chilling, baby. Nisa. Nisa, we see you chilling, baby. Can with... she, she can't. Can we? Uh... Hmm? Oh, can we talk to her? It's finna. Cut, cut, cut off. Yeah, I got the free version of Zoom, so it only give us. Yeah, I brought this. Is our first time. It's our bro. Yeah, it's our first time. I didn't know it had a limit on. So I'm gonna make a live. Yeah, I'm gonna make a live. But 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 the podcast is gonna be posted on YouTube. You're gonna be able to listen to it on Spotify. If you got an Apple device, you go to the podcast app. You can listen to us on there. Yeah. 
We we, I, we gonna I, run the whole thing back. I, had, I was coming up to speak. Man. Okay, bet. Yeah. We gonna run it live back in sixty five people. Yeah. Man. Let's see. Okay. So Miss Nisi, please jump on over to the other one. Go to the live, Nisi. Yeah. Go to my Instagram live. All right. Let me set it up. Let me see. 